Desperate search is underway for an airplane mechanic who's been missing for more than a week. Local 10's Roy Ramos joins us live from Miami with more. Roy. And family members tell us that their lives have really come to a standstill. They are just devastated with all of this. Many of them working in the healthcare industry and having to put those career uh, careers on hold as they focus 100% of their attention on finding their loved one who hasn't been seen or heard from in more than a week. It is so got wrenching, you don't know where your child is. A mother in tears after she nor friends or other relatives have either heard from or seen 37 year old Sarin Sital. His family told me Sarin, who's a son, a brother and uncle disappeared last Thursday, November 2nd. We were a very small, close knit family and we need him back. I cannot imagine life without him. His family said the airplane mechanic had left his Miami home for work at Opalaka Airport. This surveillance video shows him servicing a plane there before then leaving to work on another plane at Fort Lauderdale Executive Airport where he finished his shift and is seen exiting the hangar. This is the last time relatives say anyone would see or hear from Sarin, who failed to show up for work the following Friday. The fact that he did not come home Thursday night, did not show up for work on Friday, presents to be absolutely the strangest thing ever. Sarin's sister Karen said she has since created these flyers with hope someone will recognize the man she says has never gone a day without speaking with his family. He's a social butterfly. Like I have said in the past, he cannot go one day without communicating with anyone. While relatives have filed missing person reports in both Miami-Dade and Broward counties, they are hopeful Sarin will return, and if he's watching, this is their message to him. Sarin, we love you. We are looking for you. We will stop at nothing to find you. And when I spoke with that family, they did tell me that Sarin was also supposed to board a flight with his mother to Trinidad that Saturday. He was not aboard that flight. They are now offering a $25,000 reward for anyone that has information that would lead to his safe return. If you have that information, you're urged to contact Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers. That number, 305-471-TIPS. For now, in the city of Miami, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. Hopefully somebody out there knows something. Thank you, Roy.